On November 1st, mark your calendars because we're welcoming a witchy new moon in the intense realm of Scorpio. This new moon is a time filled with possibilities that connect to magic, transformation, and deep emotional exploration. But what does that really mean for us? Let's break it down together. That theme, embrace the mysteries. You might have heard that the moon is said to be fallen in Scorpio, but don't let that scare you. While it suggests the darker side of our emotional landscape, it also offers a powerful chance for healing and transformation. Scorpio, with its associations to themes like sorcery and alchemy, pushes us to look beyond the surface. This is a time to dive deep and explore our hidden feelings and experiences. Think of Scorpio as the master of change, guiding us through things like old wounds, hidden desires, and personal truths. In the depths of Scorpio, we're presented with a fascinating choice. We can either let our shadows overwhelm us, allowing fears, doubts, and past traumas to keep us crawling in the dark, or we can take a brave step back, shine a light of awareness on our hidden fears, and explore what they have to teach us. Consider the symbols associated with Scorpio. The scorpion, the snake, the spider, the wolf, and the phoenix. Each represents different facets of this complex sign. Do you want to embody the creeping shadow or rise like the phoenix from the ashes of transformation? Adding to this cosmic cocktail is Mars, the traditional ruler of Scorpio, who is currently in Cancer. Here, Mars can feel a bit sensitive and may lean toward emotional reactions rather than fierce actions. It's like having a warrior who prefers to stay home and binge watch instead of charge into battle. Remember, just because we feel something doesn't necessarily make it a fact. It's always vital to sort through our emotions and understand they don't define our reality. And with Mars opposing Pluto, get ready. This cosmic alignment can lead us to unearth some significant feelings, family dynamics, buried resentments, and deeper emotional patterns that need to be confronted. We can either take the will and steer this process ourselves or wait for something or someone to trigger it for us. And let's be honest, it's usually much smoother when we're the ones driving our own emotional journey. Here's the dance we're invited to explore during this new moon. The balance between control and surrender. Scorpio loves to be in charge, yet it also longs for deep connections with the mysteries of life. Embrace this tender tension by asking yourself, how can I navigate the murkiness with grace? Remember, even beautiful lotus flowers grow from muddy waters. On a hopeful note, there is support in the air. Mars is communicating with Neptune, and together with Pluto, these planets are at critical points that suggest it's time to close the door on old cycles filled with resentment and pain. Forgiveness is knocking on our doors, and help is within reach. As we foster a deep connection to what we truly desire, our lives can shift toward love and meaning. Scorpio desires depth. So as we embrace what truly matters, whether that's relationships, family ties, or friendships, we're encouraged to reflect. What am I willing to sacrifice for the things that matter most? How deep is my commitment to evolution and growth? As you navigate this powerful new moon in Scorpio, I invite you all to engage in some ritual or reflection that resonates with you. Write down what you wish to release or transform and what intentions you wish to bring into your life while this powerful time is here. Together, let's explore the darker corners of our emotions and rise anew like the phoenix. What is stirring within you this new moon? Share your thoughts below and let's support each other on this beautiful journey of transformation.